Hi, and welcome to another episode of Backwoods Cuisine. I am your host, Just Plain Philip, and today we are having ramen noodle, bumblebee light tuna. Probably not going to use the chicken flavor. That could probably would taste kind of odd with the with the tuna, but we shall see. Of course, today. I'm using a canteen cup. And the queso blue knife. Alright, so last night I made ch uh, chili with ramen noodle. And this morning, we got half a pack left. So a bit of cold. Got about a cup of water here. Mixing the ramen noodle in. And to use the queso bowl knife, stir it around a little bit. Make sure it's just all good and wet. And now into the fire it goes. Excuse me, out of the cold. And there it goes. Alright, so the round of noodle has been going for a while. And I'm about to put in the bumblebee light tuna. Yeah, they can both finish off cooking together. Take and stir it up a little bit. Just going to continue and finish off cooking together. And we should have something very good very soon. And now we'll get back with you. Alright, so we have a success here. I tried it without the chicken flavoring pack and it seemed rather bland. So I put the chicken flavoring in, and it tastes great. We have another steaming cup of success. So the only addendum I would have to this is that if you wished, you could drain off all the juice. Don't put in the flavor packet. packet. I crunch some Ritz crackers on top of it. And if, you're, if it's your first meal out, you can also put cheese on top. You make yourself a nice little casserole right over the, the fire. I may just have to do that sometime. This is Just Plain Philip. Thank you for watching and God bless.